Hey guys, it's Jezza here and I wanted to do a quick video um, on a three star strategy for lower town hall tens. Um, might work on the higher ones as well, but kind of in war these days it seems to be with the current meta of the game that your tens try to take out elevens for two stars or you try to hit the lower tens for the three star. Not usually a lot of max tens going down to Town Hall 10s. It can be done, super difficult. Um, so I wanted to show this attack. This is a um, a um, Shattered Hobo attack um, with a ton of uh, bowlers. Uh, I've got 10 bowlers and I've got five in the CC. Um, and this worked really well for me uh, on this attack. Um, really kind of ran over this base and overpowered it. Uh, there's a couple key things I want to point out um, in the video. One is, first of all, you need to make sure you get your funnel to where you can get all of your troops um, to funnel into whatever part of the base you want to enter through. Um, that's really key. Um, also, I saw here, um, you've got the Infernos here and here. I wanted to get into this compartment here um, because I was of the opinion if I got into there, could rage my bowlers up. I could get at least one of the Inferno Towers with the bowlers. And my queen would get in there as well um, and take out the additional Inferno Tower. Then the plan was to put my hogs in um, from the back side over here behind the um, kind of behind, behind the mortar and just have, let them work their way through these different defenses and around the base. So I'm going to go ahead and hit play. This is the f first part that was important was to get the funnel. And the second part is when the CC comes out, you got to get the poison down immediately. If it's a legitimate CC, um, when I did this attack before, I did this right before I actually recorded it. And I failed the attack. And the reason why was I waited too late to get the poison down. It made a huge difference on this one. I immediately got the poison down, which helped to slow the C CC down and not let that baby dragon or those Valks do too much damage. So as you can see, I dropped the jump um, and I overlaid it onto um, to one of the um, Inferno Towers so that my troops could get in there. And you see those bowlers are going and kind of clearing out the area, which pushes the queen back the other way to where the only thing she has to take out is the Inferno Tower. Now, as soon as that goes down, you'll see I put my wave of hogs in and I did it kind of old school. Um, kind of the old Asian wall of hogs um, that a lot of the, the old uh, old school clans used to use uh, before surgical really became popular but I felt like having a, a big group of them would do a lot of damage uh, and it seemed to in this attack uh, they were able to get around here um, and take out a ton of defenses still have my heel in my pocket I was able to go ahead and throw that down at the end to heal them up, make sure. I probably could have swagged it. It would have been close uh, with those being um, wizard towers because um, they can take down the group. But was able to get them healed all the way back up. And I've got, I started with 15 hogs um, and I've still got um, probably 10 left to do all the cleanup. So I finished this with about a minute to spare. So really solid. I still have some bowlers up. Somehow they made their way all the way over here. The queen's going to work her way around. The hogs are working their way around. Um, and this ended up being a good three star here. So wanted to show that it's a, a viable option um, for, for you hitting a lower town hall 10. I mean, I, I actually hit some higher level ones today with it, with max Inferno towers and some higher level point defense. Um, and was able to get the three star, but it wasn't as consistent as I was able to get it on the lower bases. Um, so I want to be reasonable about the expectations. I mean, ten on t the ten on ten game is not you're not going to hit consistently, you know, um, higher level town hall tens that have good base design and get threes. But you can get in there and get some of the you know lower to mid level tens and get solid attacks on those and get the, get the three star. So just wanted to share that with you today. Um, if you like the video, please subscribe, please like it, leave any information um, about it in the comments um, and let me know what you'd like to see more of. Um, 
Also check out any of the YouTubers on the Clash Watch app. I'll actually be adding myself um, to the app because I was told I wasn't on there and I knew that, but I hadn't met the minimum um, subscriber requirements to be on there. And I have now, so I'll add myself so you guys can check me out there as well. Um, but until next time, thank you so much for uh, tuning in. Um, this has been Jezza and I hope this helps you out. Bye.